What's up guys, AK with the CC train. Today I'm going to show you how I'm controlling a Rail Pro locomotive module. I call it decoder sometimes, no, it's locomotive module. DCC for decoders. So with uh, DCC and that's pretty much your system. It can be in two varieties. From the You can send command from computer interface USB small module or this unit HC2 handheld controller so set uh, 101 lens LZV200 and LH101 it's already connected to DCC and my functions see small reflection on the motor here it are on so F0 headlight 1 is rear light this is previous model, uh, the newer is LM3. I did it on purpose. I put new firmware and I'm testing it and, and I'm happy with this. So, old product, no issues at all. So, I'm turning F0, focusing guys on this area, my headlight. And I'm set, changing directions with the lens here. You probably hear just motor. RPM. It's not gonna fly. Probably <laughs> put propeller seriously. And uh, changing directions, turning headlight, turning on. In real life, guys sometimes forgetting, so they're running with both headlight and rear light, and that's it. Simple, right? I'll show you at the end of the video how I set up. Uh, locomotive module working with DCC. Now, if we turn both functions, it's just easy to see. Uh, when I'm uh, turning my handheld controller, it's pure touch screen. So I'm using like good stylus. Or you can do fingers but it's it will be on your way now turning the locomotive and hitting this my functions on here I'm turning them off and now check this out DCC automatically disabling nothing I'm controlling directly that through direct radio from handheld controller to the locomotive module. Turn the headlight. It's running backwards. Oops. Changing. It's like in real life. Tell you one secret. It's more speed, sp speed steps here. We'll talk about it, of course. Then turning headlight, turning rear light. Changing directions. Done. Let's do experiment. If I ch turn uh, my functions here on DCC, so no functions on DCC, I'm turning my handheld controller off. Escaping. See what's happened here? The functions goes off because DCC took over and now I'm going to show you how to set for DCC you hitting the locomotive I will do bigger screen and like focusing on step-by-step -step stuff of course uh, in the more videos coming so I'm hitting this LM2 modules module Sometimes you see warning sign. It's about voltage and other parameters not adjusted. Just check what's going on. I set up voltage already, so no no problem here. And uh, on my command station here, lens. So I'm going to this tool, hitting uh, this page. Oh, now you're probably confusing. It's a lot of information. <laughs> no, it's all um, very interactive graphical interface. So you, you don't need to worry about CVs and stuff. And we're going to, oh, nice, speed table. And here we go. 
DCC enabled address 3 or I can put any address I like this is it so that will be all for today thanks for watching supporting business if you want to su support channel there is a join button at the bottom of the video I'm, I'm starting doing a lot of uh, very cool projects there so thanks again We'll see you soon.